The statics analysis shows us that the blade model design has high bending stresses in the shaft and so requires a design refinement. With Solid Edge, we can take advantage of synchronous technology to make modifications to the design. A unique feature of synchronous technology is directional control during dimensional edits. Edits in traditional history-based CAD systems force model regeneration and explicit modelers don't allow parameterized change. Watch how Solid Edge with Synchronous Technology 2 solves both problems. Here, we can thicken the shaft by extending the larger diameter portion downwards and increasing both the larger and smaller diameters either by extending the dimension or by entering in a diameter value. These geometry edits can be done quickly and easily and without the restrictions of a feature-based CAD system. Solid Edge Simulation maintains associativity between the CAD and CAE models, so although we've made some changes to the geometry, the finite element model updates automatically to reflect those changes. Also, loads and boundary conditions have been maintained so that at this stage, all we need to do now is rerun the analysis. This time, we can see that the stress results are much lower, and so the modified design is now strong enough to withstand the potential loading without failing. The ability to validate the design digitally using Solid Edge simulation like this allows you to increase the quality of the product and ensure that it will not fail in the field. Finally, to help document and communicate the finished design, Solid Edge simulation will create a report which includes all relevant simulation data, including model information and properties, geometry, material properties, loads, constraints, connectors, mesh data, and finally, results. So using Solid Edge Simulation, we've analyzed the blade model, identified a design flaw, refined and validated the design quickly and efficiently using a virtual model. And we've achieved all of this without the time and expense of building physical prototypes.